What does it mean to be a narrative artist? I paint moments from my life. I grew up in Los Angeles in the 50s and 60s. What I saw and experienced then is part of my art today. As today, LA offered a wide variety of people and places, each with colors and sounds all their own. I'm the oldest of three sisters. My parents came to LA from Europe, making new friends like so many families continue to do. Wow, LA, Hollywood, movie stars, and all those wannabes hanging out at Schwab's. And as a kid, of course, I fantasized about being a movie star. But then came the 60s with music at the Beach Boys and heading for Venice Beach with my friends. And finally, I was driving with my radio turned on to Sunny and Cher and the Beatles, cruising with my girlfriends from Van Nuys Boulevard to Alvera Street. My girlfriends coming and going, us shopping, and oh, those hairdos. After all, a girl's got to look her best for the guys. A little homework and my date and I are off to the drive-in. Gosh, I hope my parents aren't watching this. I was so young and so unsure and impatient about my future. I studied art at CSUN, meeting new people and having new experiences, then studied in Europe and then Mexico with so many wonderful teachers, and of course surrounded by the great dance and the music. I always wanted to sing in a rock group. <laughs> So I wrapped myself into all these new experiences, but of course, without a doubt, my greatest experience was becoming a mother. All of this and more influences my art today, and now for 25 years I have enjoyed mentoring and teaching thousands of students since opening my studio and art school, The Art Experience. Others suggest I paint in the tradition of some of the great 20th century artists, but for myself, I'm just a storyteller who's fascinated by people and who cares about getting the feeling on canvas. So every day I paint, creating more stories. Now I have my Olympic story to tell as 2004's U.S. Olympic artist. My original oil, All Eyes on Me, is now reproduced in limited edition prints and commemorative posters for the 2004 Athens Olympics. I am truly honored as a woman and as an artist to be selected official United States Olympic artist and have my art benefiting our United States Olympic team. It's a very special honor. <laughs>